Let's do a little something. Cool. Just for fun, do a B-flat 7 blues walking bass line. Cool. Uh, at any tempo? Any or tempo. Certain... Do it medium so people can hear you play. Cool. Two, three, four. <laughs> Time is there, your motion is there, but sometimes I submit that the specific representation of where you are mm -hmm. in the court and where you're going isn't quite clear to me. Okay. So I hear things sort of like, sorry, my fault. Yeah. And I can't quite determine where the chord is. B flat. E flat, yep. B flat. So I'm a little more specific in this because I'm determining where we are in the harmony and where we're going in the harmony. Play me another bass line and simplify it in the manner. I'm in B flat, do, do, do. I'm going to okay. E flat, do, do. So try that and see if you can't clarify the chords better. Sure. I'm going to stop you right there. Okay. I'm going to repeat your line. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now, I don't think that's a bad line, but I would say that it isn't clearly specifying E flat. The, okay. the thing that the music will show. Okay. Seems to define one and three, and then chromatically resolving. Resolution is everything in bass. Try that again and try not to repeat notes. Okay. Cool. Okay. I'll stop you right there. I think you played. Now, so, yeah. the downbeat of a chord, on the downbeat of a bar, I submit that you didn't play a strong note. Okay. And the strong note you didn't play is a chord tone. Yeah. So while you played, I might have gone. Okay. Again, and try to downbeat every bar on a root, a third, a fifth, or a seventh. Okay. Cool. Slowly. It's okay. That's because I've academically suggested. you most of that is improved instantly in the 10 minutes that we've hung together you're already thinking about harmony which is something that i've emphasized many times to people online